everyone, and welcome to the BMW International Open. I'm stepping into the fan zone where all the fun happens. Guess what? I've been invited to the Entity Data Booth where I've been told they've got this really cool golf swing analysis technology and they keep telling me they can improve my swing, but let's put that to the test. Hi. Hi. Hi, I'm Emma. Hi, I'm Oliver. I'm CTO of Entity Data in the Dach region. Fantastic, glad and to meet you. Let me introduce my colleague Adriano. Hi, Adriano. Hi, nice Emma. Nice to meet you. Fantastic, and please, what is this Golf AI Swing technology I've been hearing about? Okay, yeah, so this technology actually captures your full body with a very simple camera and uh, analyzes your body posture, and you can correlate the body posture uh, with the quality of your uh, golf swing. Is there anybody who's willing to test it? Is there anyone who can play golf? Yes. Oh, that's you, then please come and join us and introduce yourself briefly. Hi. Hi. Emma? Lucia. Nice to meet you. Little swing analysis, small one. Perfect. Perfect. Just so that we're safe, let's just stand over here. It's a very good swing, Lucia. Adriano, could you kindly put that on the screen? Yes. Here, there is the video. So what you can see here is uh, that the body is actually recognized and that the arms, uh, the legs, the knees are all turned into digital data. So it's not unstructured data in an image, but it's structured data in numbers and computers like numbers. Yes. And these numbers can then be stored and can correlate it with the quality of the swing. And over the time with enough training data, so also the artificial intelligence needs to learn, needs to go to school, we can then train the model and the model can then advise you um, how to improve your body posture and you will probably agree that this is very important for your swing or yes. how you stand and how you swing and how you move. Uh, why does Entity Data is interested in analyzing golf swing? Well, we are in general very much interested in digitizing the world because we see a confluence of the digital world and the physical world and using this technology to, to turn these images into data help us to deliver meaningful services uh, for sports, but you can also use it uh, in medical area, for example, uh, or you can also use it for safety and track people maybe in plants and factories. And that's all the areas we are working on. Wow, very fantastic. Well, we've seen an amateur swing. Does it capture technology the same way for a professional golf swing like mine? Yeah, sure, yeah? sure. Sure? Let's see. My turn then. Thank you very much, Lucia. You've been wonderful. Thank you. Nice. This is a lovely setup. Yeah, so that was already a fantastic swing. So let's look at the data here. How is it when you see yourself? Do you see any particular strengths and weaknesses from looking at it as an expert? I think what I really like about the technology is that can we, can we, Adriano, can we stop it at the top of the swing? stop it there. I find it really interesting that I can see exactly and I'd be able to compare how well positioned or out of position my yeah. body is when I am swinging. This is really, really interesting technology that I hopefully we get to see further yeah. down the line. Yeah, and the next step is then to bring it on a mobile device so that you can take it with you, uh, make the data more accessible with a maybe traffic light system, green, amber, red and then it's uh, ready to be used by, by everyone. You would definitely have to try this out. But thank you so much for being here. We'll see you soon. Yeah. Thank Take you. Bye-bye.